It's your girl Quincy and we're live here on the red carpet of the NAACP Image Awards Luncheon. We're going to talk to a lot of great stars coming up next. Stay tuned. Virginia Frederick and you're watching Quincy on Studio Q. Well, so, no, you look gorgeous. You. So you didn't already told us about Sacred Heart. You got to tell I'm us. Sure. Go in. Go in. Oh bosses. Um, it's my favorite project to date, and I wrote it. It's winning awards. It's with, um, we did it with Jesse Smollett from Empire. We shot it in Paris, my favorite city in the whole world. And um, it's going to be released February 14th. It's at the Pan-African Film Festival. It's winning awards. And, um. And what is the premise of it? It's a love story. It's thought-provoking. It's um, there's a twist, and it's uh, it's sexy and it's it's fun. It's in it's Paris too. So. And how can like we go and and check it out? Like people who are not here to go to the Pan African Film. Yeah. Um, go to SacredHeartFilm.com. Um, the official trailer just went up. It's with one of Jesse Smollett's songs that you can only hear there. And um, yeah, go to the site. Now, as far as the Image Awards goes, how important is it now, especially with all the Oscar controversy, how important is it that we have our awards now? To me, it's always been important. Um, I, I feel like we as a people, all people of color, should stop asking. Um, you know, you only get the respect you demand. So. I think if we start asking, if we continue to create, if we pull our money together and make good work, we have to and, and acknowledge our own. We don't we really don't need them. Like, bless their hearts. <laughs> it's a trickle down effect. There are many gatekeepers. I have uh, film festivals tell us that they didn't believe the sensuality of black people, the thought-provoking, because we're not, it's not in an urban setting, it's not, um, it's not hood, we're not, I'm not a maid, I'm not a slave, I'm, you know, in a setting that they weren't comfortable with. So, it's alive and well, <laughs> it's alive and well, but I believe that the NAACP Awards, the Pan-African Film Festivals, all of these things have always been important. So, you know, if more people want to get behind it now, that's great, but I've always been a big believer in for us, by us. I heard that. I like that. Seriously. Representing. Hello. <laughs> and, and you were a part of Norse Ark. He said you were um, nominated a few years ago. Yes. Uh, a TV show we did. It was groundbreaking. Um, we only did two seasons, and we did a film for it. But the rumors are that it's going to come back. A lot of TV shows are coming back, and it's one of those that is reportedly coming back so I'm excited to see what unfolds with that yeah and final question what are some tips that you can give some young people out here who want to be you who want to you know do their own thing Wow um, to never ever ever stop don't stop creating don't stop believing don't stop you know it's really important to go after your dream because what is life without being happy or going after what you're doing Studio Q. 